It's me. pictures of tits and asses and naked women. It's all it's all women. Look, um, it's called a it's collage. A collage. It's a collage, right? It says "Wow, danger!" Wow, at the top, and then danger. It's lots and lots of boobies and anuses and tit shots and gargoyles. Lots of gargoyles. It, it was bubble wrap. It's 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 made on some kind of styrofoam <laughs> that's already bent and breaking. I think it's a, a bit of decoupage. <laughs> Is that a decoupage? I believe Jimmy was sent a decoupage of uh, boobies. <laughs> a decoupage? De decoupage. I think that's the the name you use if you're into that arts and crafts thing. Or hunk of shit. <laughs> <laughs> that's a word you might want to use. Hunk of shit. <laughs> but no, I, uh, I actually look, I, I want to thank the five-year-old that made this. Obviously, they put a lot of effort into it, so. Yeah. We'll leave it up here. Let in the me see office. that. No, don't break Let it. Let me. I, I swear to God, I won't break it. I really got to see it up close. There's actually one that. really good blowjob uh, moment here. I can't talk right now I can't. Actually calm. Who is that? Who's on the fucking uh, phone? Who doesn't know you're on the, the fucking fuck radio? On the He's phone. on the fucking radio. What the fuck is wrong with you? you? It scared me. It said, you know, alarm. It's the alarm company. Oh. But it's the. The guy that wants to do the sound system installation in my house. Does he not know uh, what you do for a living? Uh, I That's silly apparently shit not. Dick. And apparently he has no, uh, he doesn't listen because if he did, he'd know I already have a, a sound system put oh, in. Oh boy. What a fucking I went elsewhere. Like. Um, <laughs> yes. I hope he suffers in a cancer ward. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> now, what about this decoupage? Well, I'm reading. <laughs> It What's says, the back wow, of duct danger. tape on it? And then it says, there's one caption that says, I'll bend you over and fuck you with my big strap on. Oh, happy birthday, Jimmy, it says. I'd well, like to take that down to the range Jimmy, and shoot you, it. You know, Jimmy, the guy put a lot of work he in He sure this. did. Hand it to Anthony. He's got the suggestion. Where are you, I would uh, like to take it to the range and just shoot it. Can you get a video of that? Uh, I'd have to go out to Calverton to do that, though. That's worth they it. even allowed me. It's worth it. Why don't you hang your basement? Jimmy, why don't you hang this yeah. next to your picture of Black Sabbath signed? Yeah, what? why don't you do that? Hang yeah. it up on your wall in your apartment. Jimmy, don't be a listener. He... <laughs> Jeez. Jesus. I see a hacksaw and a hammer oh being gosh. brought over. Here, Jimmy. The hammer would go into that girl's head really nicely. Jimmy. The claw side. There is a girl with big, nice big tits. I can't ruin the guy's gift because he put a lot of effort into it. You could it. tell there was a lot of work put into this. Yeah, I can't wreck it. Why don't it. you get a picture for the website? The, the folks will enjoy the uh, decoupage. Picture of me holding the, the decoupage. <laughs> the decoupage. Thank you, Greg, for this decoupage. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know what it was called. Apparently, it's a decoupage. <laughs> How lovely. <laughs> the boy put so much effort into my decoupage gift. <laughs> what a birthday gift. <laughs> <laughs> who, who sent it? I don't know. Let me go check. Who is the creator of such a decoupage? <laughs> I don't quite know. Uh, this is called a boy and his decoupage, Iraq. Yeah. yeah. Well, t you know, pose with your decoupage. I did it. Iraq took a picture. Oh, okay. We're all set. All right, get that up. Now Jimmy's uh, now searching out the box. A decoupage. You got to thank the listener for sending in the decoupage. Pinos. Huh? The pinos. The Pinos, it's called the Pinos. P I N O S, the Pinos. The Pinos. Like, are the Pinos a family or, or friends? Oh, or a company? What? Or the the from, I don't it? know. Are they a, are they a decoupage conglomerate? <laughs> 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 They're taking over the decoupage industry. <laughs> uh, <Okay>. Mr. Decoupage, <laughs> out of the question. <laughs> decoupage. <laughs> a decoupage? What is it? Is that, what is a decoupage? It's, he's right. The, but I know I'm sure he is, but what is exactly that? It's the horse a collection you're of at. pictures pasted on some type of board. That'll do it. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Decoupage. Did that guy really see me? What happened? On line three. What happened? Ooh. He really see me? Oh look, boy. We're... I have a little joke here. Look. Yeah. Our honorary oh, guest for the yes. day. It's a decoupage. <laughs> Say something. <laughs> He, Jimmy right. set it up on a chair and gave it That's a microphone. That's our guest for the day. The decoupage. <laughs> it's set up. <laughs> Say something. Well, it's trying. It's shy. <laughs> it's trying, but uh, pretty much every mouth in the decoupage has a cock in it. So, <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's kind of hard to expect. talk. Right. Decoupage. Let's say hi to Steve on Long Island. Steve. Hey, how are you? Uh, hey, Steve. good. How are you? Uh, All right. So what's I'm up? On, uh, I'm on Patchogue Holbrook Road on Saturday night from Holbrook headed to a wedding, and I see this red Shelby pull up behind me, and my girlfriend's in the passenger street, and I thought this was going to be my brush with fame. I look in the rear view mirror, and it's nobody but Anthony Cumia, with a nice young lady in the passenger seat doing her makeup. 
So I figured oh. I'd wave mm-hmm. as we make the turn onto the LIE, you know, maybe get a little wave back. But hope he couldn't get past me fast enough. <laughs> Takes off like a jet. Apparently, no regard whatsoever for his last ticket. Oh really? I yeah. was I kept it under uh, ninety. Were you speeding I all over Long Island and your? <laughs> I get applause from fans. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I I don't think that was under ninety, my friend. Really? Yeah. I gotta look. Oh no, there was one point where it was about one hundred and ten. One hundred and ten. Okay. Yeah. All right. Like two seconds after getting onto the LIE. It's all good, right. It's good to know you're slowing down a little bit. Well, it was open, very open road. Right. When, so when, I might have. Uh, when Jill's pregnant with your first kid, will you at least <laughs> get it down to under a hundred when you're driving around? <sighs> All right. Thank well, you, Steve. Wow. He, 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 absolutely, though. He had a sighting there. All right. Let's go to Brad in Jersey. Brad. Hey guys. Good morning. I just wanted to thank or congratulate uh, Anthony on the whole Jill Nicolini thing because I'm a huge fan of of Jill, of course. And well, who uh, isn't? If, well, yeah, but of course, you know, you got it made too because typically when you see a hot chick with Jill. Or a hot chick like Jill with a dude like yourself, they figure he's either got a big hog or money. And you right. Got both. So exactly. You're right I got to agree with the guy. Was you she know. impressed with the big hog? It was a tin knocker. I think it would be a little rough for me to, you know. Get but you're a, my hero. That's all I want like to say. That. Punch it out. I mean, I'm his hero. What did she That's What did good. she say when she saw it? That's not too personal. <laughs> I, uh... Let me, was it, it was this. It was one of three things. It was just a... Oh, <laughs> it's a frightened sound, or was it? Holy shit! <laughs> Something along that. Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> or, or was it one of dread? Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> dread. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, jeez. It's kind of like when you get one of those big, huge sandwiches. You're like, well, i got to figure out how to get this uh, sandwich. I'll never down. finish this. <laughs> Honey, you got to pound it down a little bit. But you're not but you're not giving the sandwich back. You're all about, no, all no, right, no, I'll figure gotta, something out here. Got to eat the sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's get oh, wait, into let's some stuff. Wait, let's not be rude. Our guest wants to say something. Oh, oh the decapage. The, the decapage. I'm an ugly piece of shit and a waste of time. <laughs> oh, come oh, on. Oh, no, you're not. Oh, decapage. decapage. I'm a big disappointment in the gift arena. No. 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 Don't we, sell yourself short. We've never decapage. given any of the other Opie and Anthony gifts a microphone. That's right. Decapage. Decapage. <laughs> you just sit there and just relax. Easy. Something will, uh, you know, come about. There's a cock in the corner. There's a lot of cocks in this. There's decapage. a lot of cock in there? Yeah, there's a lot of cock when you start All looking right. a little closer. Right. Now it's decapage. not half bad. <laughs> well, that's, that's the <laughs> signature of the Pino's decapage empire, <laughs> is they will always have a cock in the corner. It's kind of like Hitchcock putting himself in his own movies. <laughs> yeah. This is corner cock. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, yes, the Pino's of Oregon, uh, the decapage yes. kings. <laughs> Could you get uh, decapage to say something else for our show there, Jimmy? This is a very, very uh, special treat for decapage. The Opie and Anthony show. Don't talk to me. I should be sawed in half. No, no, you shouldn't. Why? Why? I'm a colossal waste of time and energy. <laughs> You're not. <laughs> colossal. Uh, I, I come looking like a framed Black Sabbath picture, but instead I'm a bunch of stupid, shitty pictures glued together. <laughs> no, no. Somebody uh, took a lot of time to make you. They did. Uh, yeah, and, and glue all those things on and find a wow mm-hmm. and a danger. danger yeah they should have found a match <laughs> and some gas <laughs> and burnt me because while i am the world's only talking decapage <laughs> i am still worthless <laughs> <laughs> there might be one more t- talking decapage out there. No, there's not. You sure? The Pinos have created the one and only talking decapage. Well, I speak for all decapages. I say we suck and nobody enjoys looking at us. <laughs> Doesn't that make you kind of special, though, that you can talk? Doesn't that make you... Uh, why am I looking at the <laughs> why, why am I looking at the decapage? Because you're an ass. 
I'm talking to the fucking thing. You certainly are. Well, and geez. you just you're just gesticulating to the decoupage. I was I was using hand mannerisms yeah. but Jimmy's to the decoupage. Jimmy's no better though. He's looking around and making sure that no one knows that he's doing the old decoupage. Yes, he is hiding his mouth. <laughs> you're hiding your mouth and you're looking like but Jimmy's to the decoupage. Jimmy's no better though. He's looking around and making sure that no one knows that he's doing the old decoupage. Yes, he is hiding his mouth. <laughs> you're hiding your mouth and you're looking like this. What do you mean? I'm trying to be quiet that. for the decoupage to speak. Oh, oh yes. Okay, yeah. all right. Me. Okay, decoupage. Yeah. Yeah, but because you're, you can DMP talk. Do in the house? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't that make you special and worth something and amazing, an amazing gift for Jimmy? Yes, it makes me worth sawing in half while I yell, ouch. <laughs> Can I have the scissors? Because a decoupage, by any other name, is still a hunk of shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this thing is fucking lame. Decoupage. I represent hours of wasted effort <laughs> that could have been spent with his children. This might not end well. <laughs> oh no, Opie threw scissors at me. <laughs> <laughs> it hit me, but they bounced off. Because I'm a well-made decoupage. <laughs> All right, take a pause. You sit there and enjoy the show. When you got something, you just uh, speak up, okay? Well, I don't have any choice but to sit here while I talk. I don't have little decoupage legs, do I? <laughs> Imagine that little decoupage legs. Then I could throw myself into the garbage <laughs> and save Jim the time and effort. <laughs> I'm so sick of the word decoupage. <laughs> of course you are. I, I don't want to hear it again. I was sick of it after the first time I heard it. <laughs> All I want to say now, it would it would march itself into a trench. <laughs> yeah, of course it would, and then just leap quietly face down, knowing what a piece of shit. Of course, it is. exactly. It knows uh, it's garbage. It even looks like I even look like garbage. Just a bunch of shit thrown onto a piece of wood, cardboard, whatever, whatever it is. It's like styrofoam, isn't it? This is uh, this is amazing radio, but uh, I, I I have to like mention that somebody out there is getting married. Who is <laughs> the tech of well, guess, yeah. <laughs> Looks like I'm a wedding gift for one of these losers. <laughs> get a mic out there. Someone, I, someone there's a mic out. out there. I should get the shit beat out of me by the when the bill becomes a law guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with you. Uh, Matt Theo from New York Rice, OP. And this is for the married guy out there? Uh yes. You're getting married? Yeah, in a couple days. All right, uh, Matt, you know Matt Theo? Yeah, it's my brother. All right, well, your brother writes, Opie, my brother's in studio. He's getting married Saturday. Please make fun of him. He looks like a piece of shit. <laughs> and he's with my other brother with blonde hair that looks like a piece of shit as well. <laughs> piece of shit. Yes, we're the piece of shit brothers. And is the guy that wrote this a piece of shit too? Yeah, or? he's the biggest. Yeah, you getting married? Yeah, Saturday. Congratulations. Thank you. Any Thank story you. there, or are we Don't just you wasting time? Don't want to chime in, Anthony, about marriage and how I'm a fool and yeah, you're, stuff, you're huh? going, you're going for it, huh? <laughs> wow. How long have you known the uh, young lady? Three years. Three years. You yeah. live together. Uh, yes. Out yeah, Island. you live together out on Long Island. Mm -hmm. And uh, what made you decide that after three <laughs> years, it's time to get married? I uh, can't do much better. I mean, oh. she's a piece of ass, you know. Uh huh. You can't do much cool better. Radio, and so. You can't. That's a reason to get mad. You know what? Anybody <laughs> should say because we are so deeply in love. Yeah. That but the first thing out of your mouth was, "I can't do any better." <laughs> yeah. That is not the premise of marriage, or I think I what Maybe she sounds did, wonderful. Maybe do you promise to love, honor, cherish, and always queef the national anthem? <laughs> I do. <laughs> <laughs> so I Maybe if I did Reagan impressions, you know, then I. We'll do a little better for myself. Whoa! I think you that know, was a backhanded insult. <laughs> Are you saying that every impression Anthony does uh, has died? <laughs> no, they're all up to date. You know, he's got he's got some nice current ones. He's just saying that if, uh, if, you if know, he, he could, could do, do impressions, impressions, he'd he'd score a, a chick. He would do a hell of a lot better than he the liked. one he's marrying Saturday. That I, I don't want to put words in your mouth, but no, that's no, how no. I see it. Because it okay. has nothing to do with my sparkling personality. Yeah. Uh, it's just my impressions. Anthony's good. I've seen Anthony work. Here. Anthony's got you don't pull Nicolini just on fucking Reagan impressions. Thank you, you gotta Jimmy. You got to have money, he's cock, got... and charm. <laughs> 